Meet Margaret Hamilton, the software engineer who took us to the moon. In the 1960s, Margaret led the team that developed the onboard flight software for NASA's Apollo missions. Her meticulous coding ensured the Apollo 11 spacecraft could land safely on the lunar surface, even when faced with unexpected errors during the descent. Margaret Heafield Hamilton was born on August 17, 1936, in Powley, Indiana, USA. Growing up, she demonstrated a keen interest in mathematics, which led her to pursue a degree in the subject. In 1958, she graduated from Earlham College, armed with a passion for problem solving and a strong determination to make a difference. Margaret's foray into computer science came at a time when the field was still in its infancy. Initially working at MIT's Lincoln Laboratory, she developed software for the semi-automatic ground environment SAGE, a pioneering air defense system. It was here that Margaret honed her skills, blending her mathematical expertise with programming. In 1960, Margaret joined the Massachusetts Institute of Technology's Instrumentation Laboratory, which was contracted by NASA to develop guidance and navigation software for the Apollo missions. As the director of the Software Engineering Division, she led a team tasked with creating the software that would guide spacecraft to the moon and back safely. Margaret's work was nothing short of revolutionary. She coined the term software engineering, elevating programming to a respected engineering discipline. Her team designed error detecting and error recovering software, ensuring the Apollo guidance computer could handle unexpected situations. This was crucial during the Apollo 11 mission when alarms sounded due to data overload just as the lunar module approached the moon. Thanks to the robust software, the system prioritized landing operations, and history was made as humanity set foot on the moon. Margaret's contributions went beyond the Apollo program. Her work demonstrated the importance of rigorous testing and modular design, principles that are still foundational in software engineering today. She later founded her own company, Hamilton Technologies, where she continued to innovate in systems design and development. Margaret Hamilton has received numerous accolades for her groundbreaking work. In 2003, NASA awarded her the Exceptional Space Act Award. In 2016, she received the Presidential Medal of Freedom, one of the United States' highest civilian honors, from President Barack Obama. These recognitions highlight her critical role in advancing both space exploration and computer science. Margaret Hamilton's story is one of vision, dedication, and impact. She not only helped humanity achieve one of its greatest milestones, but also shaped the future of technology. Margaret once said, the minute you start seeing yourself as a hero, you're not paying attention. Yet to us, she will always remain a hero whose contributions inspire generations.